thing is gonna be gone tomorrow. So says the uh, fruit stand, which operates right here on a normal day. This is the weekend. And they're gonna knock down that old wooden structure in there tomorrow. Shame, but that's what they call progress, huh? Welcome back to Runner's Garden. I don't have any products to review today. There are 15 elementary schools, seven junior highs, and seven high schools in this city. I'm gonna try to hit a few of them today. They have sidewalks on the outside going around the perimeter of the, the whole school campus. And they have tracks. And I'm trying to get 15 miles today. So join me and I also wanna run up a mountain. I already hit my first stop, Anshin Elementary School. Did a half lap on their track and exited the back of their school and ran around their, their sidewalk. I gotta start running again, so um, talk to you later. I'm gonna go to Jiangxi next, do a lap on their and track. There are uh, two colleges, one technical college and uh, education university. I used to teach there for 20 years. So I'm on my, I'm calling these victory laps. It seems like I can put one of these tracks at every mile at least right now. Uh, the next one is really close, it's a stadium. And I missed, I didn't go to the Nangul Elementary School track because it's a little bit out of my way and I have to, I would have to cross four lanes of traffic. I don't want to do that. This is Jenghua Ch Technical College. This is a larger track. I like it, it has uh, seven lanes and it's a uh, 400 instead of a, a 200 like the elementary schools have. And then I'm gonna be going to those steps and going up another hill to the stadium. From the stadium, I'm going into the mountains. And then it's gonna be all downhill, all the way home. Then I think I'll do some treadmill. Found something new. I never went up this path, which incidentally goes to uh, Jingle's cafeteria and activity center. It's a pretty big campus. There's the, their big uh, landmark building. But check this out never saw it before. Maybe I saw it and I just forgot about it. Maybe I'm having heat stroke. <laughs> All the signs here are bilingual. That's pretty cool. Here's the courts where I used to play. Got to show a water feature. With the road going to the dirt trail is blocked off. I do see a little bit of construction up there. But uh, a couple weeks ago, they were spraying for the mosquitoes, dengue fever. It's actually a sign. Okay, closed till the 20th. Off limits to uh, professors and teachers and staff and students, everybody. I told my wife I would be back in one minute. <laughs> That's not gonna work. This is really weird. There's nobody here. There's usually fruit sellers up there. I'm gonna do a, a massive hill instead of going into the trail network. This is a mystery. It's been here forever, just this broken down bus. Um, I don't know why they keep it here. The windows busted out. I mean, the rest of the campus is taken, taken care of, but this has been here for years. Why do they leave it here? I haven't been here for a long time. My, uh, my running buddy, formerly my tennis buddy, we used to avoid paying 50 NT up at the courts, which are, you know, just up the hill here. And we used to come down here and play on these courts. And this is just, it's really open, it's dummy locked. So, Three courts, guys, and there's one up ahead. And they're recently, newly uh, resurfaced. I guess it's maybe two years now or so, but they look pretty good. Decent nets. This is the mountain campus of NCUE. Ending up to be a temple to temple run today. I don't know, I'm just exploring. Nice house. Uh, I try to take routes now that I don't often take.
have much needed trail business to attend to. Oh, this is very trail-like. It's these smooth rocks. And to get more footing, I'll go on these railroad ties. Go a little faster. I'm at the object of my journey, halfway point for this outside run, San Qinggong Temple, right there. I just did like a half K of uh, dirt trail, and I'm gonna hit a little downhill section of trail. The trail heads over this way, and a lot of downhill stairs before I go up again, and then back will be all the way home. I was on a training run and my friend sent me this really nice text. JC and his wife Trooper Wu set up an aid station for me. Blue Marsh Lake in Leesport, Pennsylvania. Kind of looks like a dragon. I want to slay the dragon. <laughs> Good morning, Mac. <laughs> Headed to Jacobsburg Park. This is the day before the 50K. And I'm just gonna, I have all my gear on and I just wanna do like a trial run and also try two different pairs of shoes. Just feel, try to get a feel of what I wanna run in. Well, I'm at Jacobsburg. I just saw a runner go up that way. See him? And it uh, looks like there's a trailhead down here. I like to get some dirt. I need some dirt. The only problem is the new pair that I bought, I only ran in twice. Haven't done big distance on the uh, UA Infinite, the Hover Infinite which I'll do a review on. So I'm gonna go put those on and check those, see how they work on this trail. Three words for you, rocks, roots, and hills. About 54 degrees. Oh, feels good. It's one of the Crayola buildings, Crayola crayons. Picking up burrs on my clothing, you can tell I was in the woods. 